And while we are live here at the state capitol, the focus of Newsom's gun control initiative, not going to be on the state capitol today, but instead on county clerk's offices statewide, as Newsom wants you, not lawmakers, to be the ones who have a say on the ballot. Newsom says he now has enough signatures to qualify his gun control initiative on the November ballot. So today, that means that Newsom's campaign is expected to start delivering those signatures to county clerk offices for verification. If his proposal qualifies for the ballot, it would create a first of its kind requirement for the purchase of ammunition. So let me run through it real quick. Here's the highlights. This proposal would require background checks for ammunition at the point of sale. No other state in the nation has that right now. It would also ban magazine clips with more than 10 rounds of ammunition, and it would make all gun thefts a felony. Currently, the theft of guns worth less than $1,000 is only a misdemeanor. Now, back out here live, Lieutenant Governor Newsom says that internal polling shows that 70% of California voters support this type of legislation. However, he does say he expects a vigorous and aggressive challenge from gun rights advocates. Especially since, keep in mind, when he was mayor of San Francisco and he got married in Montana several years ago, those same gun rights advocates went all the way to Montana to protest. Live at the State Capitol, Mike Sell, KCR Ray 3 News.